I'm Colin Fitzgerald with Arrowhead Camper Sales in Mayfield, Kentucky. We're going to take a look at our 2025-2606 WS Rockwood Ultralight Travel Trailer. This is a two-slide rear bath model from Rockwood. Uh, this floor plan's been built for a while. I want to show you some things that changed for 25. And we're going to go inside first and take a look there. So again, 2606. Uh, one big thing, this is the 50th year for Rockwood Flagstaff in production. So um, an awesome product. If you're researching this, you probably already know that. You don't need me to tell you that, but um, pretty, pretty tough to be a Rockwood travel trailer. So again, rear bath, you come in this, you've got your, your living room here, kitchen to the right, bath to the left. We're going to start in the front, but I want to kind of show you the general layout. Bath to the left and then bedroom up at the front. Okay. So looking from the rear of the unit forward, and we're going to start up here in the bedroom. So two slide model, um, WS with wardrobe slide. Rockwood does use a wardrobe slide here to the left. Um, because of that, you really open up these bedrooms. Um, versus not having one at all. So you got hanging storage and um, shelf storage here. Like I said, because of that, you don't have to have those two little claws that you usually do on both sides of the bed. You've got an open area, um, which really helps you from not feeling like you're crawling into a cave at night. So big windshield at the front. Rockwood's been using that for a while. There is a big nightshade there uh, to pull down and, and cover that if you, if you need to. Storage above. On both sides of the bed, you can see there's end tables with storage, uh, USB ports, and 110 outlets. Those are on the inverter circuit. There's the inverter control there. Below the bed, Rockwood always does a good job with their storage down here. Aluminum bed base, struts to hold it up. It's finished out really neat and well. There's drawers also. Also point out with Rockwood, the, the quality of the mattress, um, yeah, it's probably not gonna be maybe your, your, your 10 inch thick uh, home mattress, but it's much better than what we see in a lot of products that they try to put something in here that is legitimate. So we always appreciate that. This particular unit has two airs on it. So you can see one air here, one air in the back. They're both ducted. TV hookups on the wall over there. Uh, and there's a backer so you can put a TV on that on that wall and have that um, swing out toward you. And then a big door. One of the things about this floor plan that everybody likes is the width of these doorways and how open it is. Um, you can see that this door and the bath door, it's very, very open. It's a, it's a, it's a straight shot. So people that don't like to be enclosed or those with you know more mobility, uh, restricted situations generally like this floor plan kitchen to the left when we come back out solid surface countertops countertop extension on this large sink with a sink cover here backsplash all around the entire way around as you can see glass top stove cover so if you're not going to use that you've still got countertop space uh, various storage compartments obviously they do a good job with their cabinetry magnetic catches um, hidden hinges there as you can see max air fan here in the kitchen that's an option that we got on this one Stainless steel microwave above there. Big fridge, you know, these have just really caught on in the last two, three, four years. Big 12 volt refrigerator, freezer on the bottom. I always show this, Rockwood does a great job of um, just trying to show people what their product has. You can pause the video and read that if you want because I will forget some of this. Right above us is the other air conditioner. So you can see they're both ducted. Across from that's gonna be our um, dinette table. So we have storage below that's accessible. They put drawers. Um, sometimes products don't do that and it's really hard to get into that so i appreciate them doing that this table generally everybody loves this table it's heavy it's one of the the negatives to it but it's solid it's movable you can take it out so people will take it outside but put it out here in the middle to play cards or take it out completely if they just want to have like a lounge area but uh, we've loved the rockwood table for for years now they've been doing that uh, in these room in this room on these windows you're going to have day and night shades you can see there's a day and there's a night so in the bedroom of course there's just going to be a night shade this is the manuals. Rockwood, I point this out because they do a good job of organizing this. Um, it's just so neat and easy to navigate, put together for the owner. And then also this is your tire pressure monitoring system. I have that out. This product does have that as well. Notice on the slide, it's a flush floor slide. There is no step up. That's an easy way for manufacturer to save some money. Rockwood puts a flush floor slide. There's no carpet, it's woven vinyl. And notice the height of it, um, it's a tall slide. It's not. Um, not shorter and then look at the depth. It's a full three foot deep slide. So nice big super slide here um, To give you lots of extra space Theater seat option in this it's right across from a TV So we feel like that makes sense in this particular floor plan center console. There's a wireless charger. There's cup holders on both sides as well And then reading lights above that again right across from that's the TV TV with sound bar built in you can see it's got uh, if you're into I don't know some of y'all don't care but um, as far as integrations, it's got built into it there uh, by Connex. Storage below, fireplace below as well. There is various storage compartments here. These are going to be shallow because behind that, we've got our pantry. 
the motion sensor light in here. Um, I like they put little coat hangers here to make it double as a pantry and a coat closet. But again, that's floor to ceiling storage right there, hidden behind that TV. The control panel's right there. So you got your monitor panel, lights, uh, tank heaters, because it does have an enclosed underbelly with tank heaters, water pump, um, and then you got your water heater switches there, slide and awning, because all that's centrally located. Before you go into the bathroom, you got your solar controller. Um, this is a Go Power system. They've been using that for a while. We've loved it. It's easy to use, easy to operate. Big sliding door here again. It, it's very, very wide and easy to get in. That's one of the advantages to this particular floor plan. Glass shower doors. This is a nice shower. Full plastic surround, hanging store, hanging storage shelves, skylight as well. Max air fan in here with a cover. A window on the back wall. I'll point that out because it's an easy way to just cut some money out by not putting that but rockwood does it it keeps it from feeling like this is just like a, a closet um foot flush toilet porcelain toilet of course really nice linen closet in this bathroom and then down here usually this is excess no it's not it's below the sink to your uh, yeah you're able to get to your water pump back here really easy uh and then there's other water connections accent light below as you can see down there and then a medicine cabinet with storage here so that is the inside. Let's go outside, take a look at some more stuff. I'll try to show this flyer that Rockwood makes on the door. Again, you can pause and read all this. They do a great job of um, showing all the features they have. At the door, notice it's a friction hinge, but they also have a catch uh, so that if it's really windy, you don't have to rely on just the friction hinge. Key alike system, so every compartment's on the same key. Grab handle there at the door. Um, large grab handle instead of having just a little handle. They usually use a wider door than most products as well. Uh, more ride step above steps also. Notice this has an optional auto level system. Um, that this, this unit is by BAL. That is an option that we got on this particular unit. Huge electric awning. Um, they could not have gone any bigger given that compartment door. They even put a center, uh, as you can see, a center support just to try to help uh, with the size of this awning and, and to prevent any issues down the road. Outside speakers on this, outside TV hookup. Rockwood's been doing this for a long time. The little rail here, you can put a, a griddle on it. There's a table that comes with it. Um, you can watch TV out here because you have coax and a outlet, so it gives you lots of options. Uh, Goodyear endurance tires, Dexter axles, and then the tire pressure monitoring system. So if you're somebody that travels, you are, you are good to go. You are set up. Composite wall construction. Um, so instead of using Luon, they use a composite. Um, if you were to get water in it, uh, which is it's a rarity with Rockwood, but if you were to get water in it, hey, you've got that instead of Luons, you don't have to deal with mold and other decomposition issues. All bonded except for the floor. So bonded rear wall, bonded roof, bonded slide ends. The best way to build a fiberglass product, in my opinion. We got a uh, spare tire on the back with a cover, storage rack on the back. You can see the, excuse me, receiver on the back for a storage rack if you want to add that. A ladder on the back. Some products have gone away from that. Rockwood's still using that to make it easy for the customer to get on the roof. 50 amp service, of course, with two airs on it. Outside spray port with hot and cold water. The water hookup area, they've been using this for a while. The antifreeze inlet. Um, there's a valve at the pump. You can turn that and then turn your pump on and stick your hose here. Man, is it nice for winterizing. It's super simple. City bar connection, black tank flush, and coax connections there. That's your fresh tank fill. Back here at the back, you're going to have your uh, gray and black for the bath. Rack and pinion slide here. Again, there's an auto level on this system. You can see that. Frameless windows, very dark tint on these. We got slide covers on this also as well as an option. Up here at the front is going to be your uh, front gray tank for the kitchen. Drop frame storage. So on this particular floor plan, uh, you've got a killer storage compartment. So well finished out. Rockwood does a great job. Um, there's your griddle over there. There's a table that goes on that rail. They even have a the manual handle mounted on the wall there nice and neat there's the inverter we talked about for several of the outlets if you need that backup power but huge storage because of that drop frame and, and it's wide as well magnetic compartment door holders um, and then you've got slam latch compartment doors as well double battery box so if you wanted to add a second battery you could two 30 pound bottles instead of 20s and then again auto level with the electric tongue jack so 2025 2606 rockwood travel trailer uh, two slide model the link in the description goes to our website or you can call text or email anybody in our family we'll be happy to give you more information on specs pricing send you more pictures whatever you want so you know on behalf of my family and our dealership arrowhead camper sales thank you for watching have a great day